Morning, it is the 21st of January, it's the weekend, therefore it's time to work and do more jobs in the house. <laughs> Last night we had a bit of fun though, yeah. didn't we Koa? Yeah. The Bullcock valve for the water tank stopped from working properly so the water was open and all the water came down the house, yay joy joy. So I've got to go up there and uh, disconnect it and replace it, <laughs> small little job but a bit of a pain because it's a very very tight space. And then we can get onto the jobs for the rest of the day. All right, it's going up. Fortunately, we got a vacated wasp nest, not a live one. Otherwise, this could be very, very interesting. The wasp nest, though, is the least of our worries. This beam here is practically disintegrated and that is holding the roof up. So we will need to replace that at some point. But just look at that rot. Oh, no, not looking good. We've got the tightest space up here, which is great, but this valve, which you can't see, because oh, there it is, kind of. Uh, it needs replacing. It is kind of working, but I don't trust it, so I want to replace it. So that's going to have to come out today. So I picked up a replacement huh? valve, and it cost £5.93 from the local builders and merchants on Amazon. These things go for about 20 quid. So do check with your local builders, merchants or plumbers for a better price. There we go, the new valve is on. And hopefully, we don't get a leak now. God, I love working in tight spaces. There we go, all working. Friendly reminder, that's why we don't drink hot water or cold water that is from a water tank like this. Not very nice, is it?